Hello everyone, welcome back to another Hollow Knight bingo. It's been a while since I've done one. And this one's gonna be pretty crazy just because of the goals we ended up getting. Uh, there's some really hard ones <laughs> that are gonna take a lot of time. There's a couple easy ones that we can just, are kind of like a throwaway, but I think overall this is gonna end up taking quite a bit of time. And some of these will be a struggle, so. Yep, I guess we might as well get started. <laughs> okay, so one of them is King's Pass Blindfolded. Um, okay, here's what we're gonna do. So I have to do the whole thing blindfolded, but it doesn't all have to be at once. So we're gonna do the first part here. I'm now blindfolded by closing my eyes. And then I can resume from as far as I got later. Where's the tick-tick? Or crawl it, I know it's here somewhere. I just have to make it to the wall. Wait, what's happening? Where am I? That's the Geo Rock, right? Why did I hit an enemy? Huh? Where am I? What am I hitting? Let's just see how far I can get. I know I've made it to the far right. What? Where am I? Was that a fly? Did I make it? Okay, I went back to the start. All right, chat. We're gonna we're gonna um resume this later. Also, this is my skin. This is the Laurel Knight skin. Very pretty. Cut grass. Oh right. Okay, we need to count manually count the grass because I can't find the current patch mod. So. One, two, three, four, five. We'll reach it very soon, just in crossroads. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. I think that was, I hit two at once there. Seventy. One, two. Ninety-two, ninety-three, ninety-four. <laughs> this is why I wanted the tracker. Ninety-five. Because you can't tell if it's two sometimes. Was that two? I don't know anymore. Whatever, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100, let's go. Also, there's a chance here for a spike kill. Let's go, there's one, one spike kill. Pull down to look down. I defy you, game. That was a good, that was an easy uh, objective. Okay, so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to make it to Hornet, the intended route, but I'm not going to fight her yet. But we're going to take the intended route through Green Path, so no fireball skips, no enemy pogos. Alright, time to do the fireball skip! Oh, I missed the chat. We have to go around. Wait, I have to go to the right? So you go through here, and then you go down, and then left. And you have to, like, cut these things. Wow, imagine having to do this ever. It actually does feel, like, really weird doing this. That didn't count as an enemy pogo, okay? This could be reached normally. Like that. Okay, then you go this way, and then I think Hornet shows up here? Yeah, hi Hornet. This path is so long and unnecessary, isn't it? Why am I doing this route? Uh, it's, you know, it's actually been retimed and it's faster in the speedrun. Don't ask how. Oh, and Hornet's here too, and she runs away. Right. And she's in this room and jumps around? What? I've never seen that one. What the hell? Because that one never shows up after. Oh, I have to pay a toll? The real route costs money. Okay, from here on out, this is the normal any percent stuff. Oh, right, I need to be imitating enemies. Hold on. There's one. I have made it to Hornet the intended way. And now I'm gonna proceed to not fight her. Because that's not a part of the objective. <laughs> I'll come back for you later. You there. What sound do you make? Oh my gosh. I don't think I can make that sound. Okay. 
Oh. That's that guy. Hold on. Okay, I'm gonna focus on getting pierogi, because pierogi can cause me to lock myself out of a goal if I save any other grub. Oh yeah, I have to make more impressions. Wow. 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 Okay, don't save grubs, everyone. Remember the golden rule. Leave them all behind. Okay, setup is ready. Yes, there we go. Okay, claw. Claw get. There we go. Okay, so pierogi, as you should know by now, is the kingdom's edge grub behind, like, the hidden wall. Everyone knows that's pierogi by now. If you don't, you're not a true grub fan. Pierogi, my beloved! Alright, we got the objective. Let's go. But discovered! I'm smacking that one dude's butt. <laughs> Imagine not knowing Bardoon's name. Disgraceful. Hold on. Huge progress in the enemy imitation. Whoa! 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 That's eight. Do these ones not say Rava? Is it only the spear guys? Help! <laughs> that was pretty bad. What? We'll end it off with a Rava. Hezo! Never mind. I had to do that one. Boy! I'll still do Rava though. But that was ten. Rava! Ow. Okay. Crystal heart? Oh my gosh. Epilepsy warning on the C dash. Jeez. I have a passive spells one, right? Only charm damage. Okay, yeah. Charm damage. This would count. This is probably the best charm damage you can actually do. I should maybe. I can't get thorns yet. <laughs> no dash. No! <laughs> That's an extra essence I have to get rid of. I don't want essence drops. Every extra essence is more time wasted. Y'all wanna, uh, dodge some Revic for a bit? I don't even have dash. Maybe I shouldn't do it yet. I need a timer. Let's do it! Alright chat, so welcome to, uh, Revic dodging for two minutes. Ah! So the strategy you want to use is, uh, the main goal is to just jump over him. So I'm going to mostly just be trying to jump around it, but I'll also downswing just in case to, uh, to have the chance of getting the parry, which makes it take longer for the return. I was under the assumption I just have to not die for two minutes. What do you think, Chad? Do I have to do hitless? I could do it hitless. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Come on, first try, first try, first try. Oh my god, I needed that parry, holy crap. Two minutes, let's go! Let's just see how long he go. <laughs> Apparently two minutes and like four seconds. Let's go to Lem. And then we're gonna upgrade my nail. Money! That's enough money, right? Juncha. So now we have coiled nail. <laughs> These things are fun to imitate. Okay, I think it's time to try and do Hornet Shawless. Let's see. Hornet? You better not say Shaw, okay? She doesn't say it like right at the start or anything, right? No, she says Gadama. Gadama! 
That's the strat. Okay, like what? How? I need. I, I need to stagger her fast enough so she doesn't do it. That was ha, right? That was ha. Damn it! Oh my god, we did it! We did it! That was so fast! Holy crap! <laughs> I didn't realize the fight was that short. When you have like this nail upgrade. Oh my god. And now I can finally get Shade Cloak. Can I do this with just wings here? Okay, good thing I got wings, because otherwise I would have needed soul. Okay, we're finally gonna get Shade Cloak without Mothwing Cloak. I hope everyone's excited to see how how this operates. What happens when you do this? Shade Cloak. Oh. As you can see, the game crashes. No, that doesn't actually happen. Nothing happens! I can't- I still can't dash. And it doesn't even like show up here that I have it. Well, time to get normal dash. This fight's gonna last like five seconds. Shit! I didn't get the five second match. That sucks. That was Shawless, yep. The double Shawless run has been achieved. Never been done before. I can dash! I'm free! I can dash! I can fight! I think it's time for Soul Tyrant. I need to get Dive. Or, you know, Soul Master. Let me just read it to make sure I know what it says. Beat Soul Master without jumping. Very simple. Can you get down here? Oh shit! Can you- Okay, you're here. Now's my chance. Oh, I learned how to dodge it. Can you- God damn it. Can you come down here? My- my chance! <laughs> I got one hit. Easy! Uh oh, this one might be a bit tough. Wait. Nope, you can get up swings. Let's go! <laughs> See, this is why I got my nail upgrades. I can't jump! Nah, it's over. We already killed it. The no jumping rule has been removed after the cat boy was murdered. Rainbow dive! This is the best dive. Pull for dream nail afterwards. We could do that. That's not related. The goal doesn't say, and leave Marissa alive, you know? Alright, this is now a dual performance. Gonna, do I just like, do the same notes? Hold on, I need to like, prepare. <clears throat> I don't think I can hit that note. Oh, I know this part. kind of do it. Uh, there we go. I actually hit that? What the fuck? Okay, we're good. Now kill her. No, now we pull. I like how you've all lost faith in me. Like, last time we did this, it was Scurry Decides. And I think I killed her. <laughs> and now 4% are voting on my decision. Alright, no wins. <laughs> Big surprise here. But you can't account for my chaos! No, we're good. Oh, I know what we're gonna do right now. So, what are we doing right now? <laughs> we're going to do King's Pass Blindfolded. Remember to subscribe to the video. Okay, chat, here's what we're gonna do to emulate the start of King's Pass. I'm gonna fall off the cliff. 
and then it'll begin after I fall off the cliff. How do you know I'm blindfolded? Uh, I am. You just have to trust me. Monitor off and eyes closed. Okay, here we go. Okay, I'm falling. I can hear myself falling. I'm gonna turn up the volume. And we're gonna go all the way to the right. Make sure I get all the way to the right. A little bit left, right? Double jump into the secret with Fury. Keep going, hit the wall, climb up all the way, C dash. Cancel. Too early. I don't know where this re. Where am I? I'm at the rock, so it spawned me on the left, right? So I just have to like. Go over here. Up here. What'd I hit? Is a wall next to me? Uh oh, I might be lost, chat. Am I in the little hole? Oh, I never broke the thing, did I? Did I? No, I should have broke it. What did I just break with right now? I heard like a breaking thing. What? What is that? Why do we hear a bug? Where am I? Wait, what was that noise? There's a lore. Wait, which lore is this? Oh my god. <laughs> Even with C dash and claw, I'm like struggling. I'm looking, I'm restarting. What the shit? What happened? Okay, C dash all the way. I'm gonna do the same strat I did last time. Wait, what was my health at? I literally forget. Am I like about to die? Am I where I think I am? If I am, I should find spikes, yes. That, there's a wall here, so I made it up, right? Oh shit, what happened? Where am I? Oh no, did I fall down? I died! Okay, I should have healed before this. Attempt number three. <laughs> oh. I didn't even have to get hit by the spikes that time. One wall, two wall. Jump to the right, C-dash. We're out. Let's go! Pet Mossy. <laughs> oh yeah, we could do uh, Shade Cloak. Mossy. You know what? After a rough start, I feel like this bingo's actually going pretty well. So this one, I have to go through all the entrances. I need to go through here. I'm just gonna... Just for the sake of completion sake, Oh god. There's no transitions besides that one, but I'm gonna go through this whole room just because I feel like that's kind of a requirement. So I'll go through as if I'm getting the... The notch! Look at that! Oh. I did it. Okay, that counts as this room complete. Grim child? Grim child? Grimchop! Okay, we're good. I can't get soul. I literally, I can't get soul. <laughs> okay. Really? That hit me. No. No. Yes, Grimchop, shoot the little ones. Frick! I don't even have Ismas. Up! Ah! Don't give me essence, I don't want essence. So just head back to the other route. And go to Umu this time. Oh my goodness. Just outrun Grimchild. Oh wait! Archives counts, doesn't it? I think Archives counts. Because there's jellies in here. There we go. I made it through. 
Okay, fine. Since we're here, we might as well fight Umu with these charms. And you know what? We should do Umu with only charm damage. That's a bad idea. Go Grimchild, get damage in. Insane damage, let's go. <laughs> I get two Grim Child hits and one Dream Shield per cycle. Oh, two and two. That was so fast. <laughs> I think it's because my nail is so powerful, right? My nail makes Dream Shield more powerful or something. I was not expecting it to be done with that, that quickly. <laughs> And now it's QGA time, let's go. So I just have to get QGA three times in a row. As a uh, skilled speedrunner, this won't be any problem at all, actually. One. Okay, it's harder because I have Shade Cloak and the timing on the wall cling is different. That's my excuse. God damn it! One. God damn it! One. Two. Three! Why did I get a Windows notification? Four. I got four. I was gonna keep going, but I, <laughs> I failed. Alright. So once Trader Lord spawns, I can only use Sharp Shadow for damage. And I get like an early hit. Yeah. Biggest thing I have to keep note of is like the, the cooldown. That didn't hit. That was a scam. Okay. Not doing super great. I'm not used to this playstyle. Wait for the backup or the jump. There we go. Now, how much damage does this do? This isn't based on nail or anything, right? This is just probably some really low damage amount. No, why did I do that? Okay, that's why you don't commit before the attack starts. No! Why would I go for that? Heal. Okay, you just ran into me. When do, since when do you do that? You've not been doing that the whole time. Do you, do you learn that later on? Does this dude learn walking into you halfway through the fight? Why didn't we just do like Mossy? Why did I do this? I could have picked Mossy Boy. That would have been a lot easier. Someone's like, oh, Trader Lord's a good idea. No, it's not. I could have done like Moss Charger, Bruz Mother, but instead I choose to torture myself. Why would you do that? Oh my god, I get into the rhythm and then he mixes it up. Leapfrog, we're playing Leapfrog now. Leapfrog strats. Let's go! Okay, that was a satisfying kill, actually. It feels satisfying to get a kill with this charm. Alright, so... We're gonna kill Hive Knight to the to Buck Bumble now. Oh yeah, I'll have to turn off game music. I'll do that. No, I don't want B essence. This is not low TB. We can only attack to the beat of Buck Bumble. 
on the boat, no, it's time to rock with the finger the bump, 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 bump to the bump to the bump to the bass, bump to the bump to the bump, bump to the bump to the bump to the bass, bump to the bump to the bump, bump to the bump to the bump to the bass, bump to the bump to the bump, bump to the bump to the bump to the bass, bump to the bump to the bump, bump to the bump to the bump to the bass, bump to the bump to the bump. Let's go. Yet another goal. So we only have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight left. And one of them involves playing an entirely different game, which is the one we're gonna do now. So this is another Metroidvania that I have played and I made a video on it. It's a good game, but it has a Hollow Knight reference, or a few if you count the Kickstarter stuff. Oh, the movement in this game, yo. I remember this game. Hold on, let me wrench myself real quick. It's here, right? Yeah, Hollow Knight. Hello, Hollow Knight from Hollow Knight. Hello, Haiku from Haiku. So where are all the spikes? Okay, there's another one. So I believe that is six. No, come on. Wait, there's is there one more? There we go, that's seven. See if I can get a double. Squat up. That's a double. So one more. And someone said there's one in the secret area? No! There we go. <laughs> That's 10. So what I'm gonna do is at least attempt to do flower quest. Actually, wait, we should do collector first. So I don't know if this is gonna be possible without like more health upgrades and stuff. I should probably have some health charms on, but I don't think I have any right now. So <laughs> let's just see what happens. If I feel like it's not gonna work, then we can come back with more health. Don't do the damage tank, that's just gonna make it worse. Okay, I can't move from this spot. I'm realizing now this is pretty bad, isn't it? I have a problem with uh, aspids because they just float out of range. <laughs> no, I tried to. No. Okay. Okay, you can't hit the jar when it's above your head. This asshole, dude. One aspid spawns. And it's just, you're done for. Oh, you missed. I'm probably dead though. I'm probably dead. <laughs> no, my charm! Wait, that's two charms! I forgot, I'm using two breakable charms. Grimchild, oh my gosh. We have fully leveled Grimchild. Yes, damage of my minions. Protect me! Good punish, the grim child punish. No! I think we need like more health, we need something more. I don't really know what to do. Weaverlings plus grub song is probably better. Okay, weavers. Okay, extra mask for good luck. Frick, I got one hit of that. Oh my god. There we go. What hit me? Oh, there's an aspid. I'm in the corner. Oh, but there's two aspids. Oh god. Get out of here. Oh my god, we did it! Let's go! I didn't need anything more. I have three health. Thank you for carrying me, everyone. My friends. Spiderlings and Grimchild. Okay, so now we just got Pantheons and Flowers. Okay, so luckily, uh, one of our objectives is break ten flowers. Even if we mess up, at least for the first ten times, we're making progress still. So it's Elderbug, 
Oro, Godseeker, and then additionally you can get dialogue from Emilitia and White Lady, but they decline it. Oh my god, I'm a stash into a crawler. Uh oh. No, you're an asshole! Oh my, I got so close to Elderbug. That's what I was going for. Well, that's one flower, bro. I genuinely don't know which way is less bad. They're... Every path to Elderbug is terrible. Ah! Don't goop me. Part of getting all dialogue means all dialogue options. Oh, my mistake. Yes, very foolish of me. I don't know why I thought you would go to so much effort for a simple old bug. Get owned. Yes! There we go. I can really have it. My, my, I barely know what to say except thank you. Thank you, my friend. I'll take care of this flower while you're gone, so we can enjoy it together when you return. Yay! Alright, I need to get more flowers now. Okay, now let's do Oro. That one's pretty close by. Ah! This one's not that bad, right? Oh my god, Aspid. Can you not make this hard for me? Let's go, first try. Oh wait, I don't even have your nail art yet. I think I need to get this. Hopefully you don't- don't break my flower while we're fighting. Uh, you want this flower? Do you want- Do you want this flower? Bama. Bama. Have a flower. I have no use for such things. Take it with you, or else I'll toss it outside to be eaten by a vermin. Kind of a dick. Wow, you ought to change a heart quickly. Two out of five. Now Emilitia and White Lady are the two left. And then Godseeker, but Godseeker I need to do Pantheon, so that's gonna have to wait until uh, we do the Essence anti-grind. Okay, Emilitia, we go down this way. I don't even have it open! Wait! I don't have the door open. How do you open the door? It's like, it's in Isma's. Did I hit the lever after done? You're a dick. Okay, that's two flowers broken. I'm just gonna go frickin' open it up. Open your damn door. We'll get it this time, because I, I don't even have to do anything besides go to the door. Yes. Keep your faint flora bug. I have enough of my own to tend. And surely you'd agree that mine are far finer. Yours are lame. Just like you. Get owned. And now let's go to White Lady. Ah! I thought I landed further left. <laughs> ah! Come on, I... <sighs> Mine. I've never done this. That's interesting, you can even do that. Hello. Oh, I haven't even talked to you yet. <laughs> Hi. Yeah, yeah, I know there's like important stuff going on, but do you want a flower? Ah, what a precious gift it offers. Though alas, I shan't accept. There's rare power hidden in those frail petals. To hold it so close, one must surely be unaware of its nature. Alright, time to break it. That is six. And now... We must grind, chat. Alright chat, we return to the birds. But this time, instead of gaining essence, we must give the essence back to the birds. It all comes full circle. We're gonna time how long this takes. <laughs> we, I, I think we're gonna need some music for this.
Ten left, chat. There's ten left. This took two and a half hours. Last one, let's go. Exactly 2.30. I'm gonna miss it by like... No! I missed it by a couple seconds. Zero! There we go. We got rid of every essence using Dreamgate. Hello. So I'm gonna start with all bindings, because all bindings is probably less annoying than hitless. Actually, I'm not sure. That's debatable. Dude, I can't heal in this fight, I swear. It's always stressful in all bindings. Oh, bad. Why would I think that was okay to heal there? No! Please don't! Don't die after all this. Okay, we're good. There's the all bindings one. So now we begin the grand trek, which I've also... I've not only screwed myself in regards to the God Seeker objective, but I also screwed myself in every time I fail the Pantheon hitless, I have to get the flower from here. So this was a very big mistake. There's like floaty guys here, right? The mushroom guys? Oh my god. Ah! Where are they? I don't know where these things are. There's none here. Why would there be any here? I'm just scared. You're not gonna hit me, right? Okay, we made it. Hello! I have flower! Creeper! I'm not the creeper from Minecraft, I'm Hollow Knight from Hollow Knight. An offering. Yes, the crawler makes an offering to us. Rare bloom, tiny and pure. No god though. No godliness, but still. No, no. Crawler presumes too much. The gift is ours, kept by us. But our mysteries will be preserved. And that is... Wait! Someone wanted me to do this, so we'll do this. This petal's so white, can you see them too? Watching me from wherever you are. Perhaps dreams aren't such bad things after all. There we go. Listen, ideally I don't break this flower until after the Pantheon. Alright. Flower. In inventory. Now just do Hitless Pantheon 1 and then we're good. We can end the rando. It's as simple as that. Alright, Hitless mode, Hitless mode, Hitless mode. Don't damage tank, don't damage tank. Don't listen to the your brain telling you to damage tank things and play risky. Don't do it. Now that's the only way you know how to play, but just don't. For this one time. Don't lose this to Mossy, okay? Don't lose the Hitless run to Mossy. I'm literally not even going to pet Mossy, I'm too scared. Five? Oh no, this is going to be where I lose it, isn't it? Ah! I panicked. I usually just don't dodge these. That's usually my strat. <laughs> no! Don't scream skip. <laughs> I hate Hitless White Defender because some bullshit's gonna happen! There's the 10th flower, chat. <laughs> okay, focus mode. Focus mode. I have the flower. Oh my god. Don't jump, please. Hitless is so freaking stressful. Okay, here's the freaking tough one. Screw this one. Nice. This one might be a bit tough, I don't like this one. Oh my god! I freaking hate hitless challenges, dude. Why do I even put them on the bingo list? 
Ah, uh, it's so bad. I'm trying to pay attention to the goop and him, and it's like, oh my god. My brain is overloaded. Oh my god, at that goop. Okay, we're on the final one. Guess so. I feel like some bullshit's gonna happen in this fight. Oh my god. What do you do about that? Ugh. Let's go! <laughs> Finally. Uh, and that is bingo! That one actually took a long time. But I, that's on me for picking some of these <laughs> as options. Last night I watched the Sonic movie for the first time. And I don't know if this is a spoiler, I guess a minor spoiler for a joke. There's a point where Sonic goes up to like a camera on one of the robots and is like, What's up? Sonic here. Welcome to my live stream. I'm like, why is Sonic literally st like using my joke? That's my joke. Hey! <laughs> Here's me. What's going on? Welcome to the stream, everyone. God damn it, Sonic.